Hi everyone, this is the Simplex Center with a special announcement. So, what's been going on right now, why everything is completely shut down, is the fact of this COVID-19 that's been going around lately. And uh, so far in Minnesota we have one death, as you all heard on the news. But anyway, just one quick announcement. I still will be uploading videos up on YouTube. Especially with that uh, one video that was about uh, Limco blowing up his boss's office. So, another announcement that I want to make is about this. 20th Century Fox will no longer be made for GoAnimate. So, for new GoAnimate videos, I will be using this new feature. That I've been planning all along. It's been about uh, three years since I planned on it. This one is called uh, King World Century, like you guys uh, saw in Path of Star Killer. Now, the reason why I didn't mark that as Null Limits 2 is because uh, it was presented by King World Century. King World Century is a movie company. Yeah, it's a movie company. You know, like, you know, originally from CBS. However, it was pronounced as just King World. I decided to reborn uh, King World Century as of uh, my movie channel. So, there's kind of another branch in it. Also, I'm also planning on uploading educational television videos. So, yeah. That's pretty much what's going on right now in uh, today's world. Empire Builder, I do not know if I'm going to uh, put that up yet. But, Educational Television, Empire Builder, Zipplex 4051-20, and No Limits 2 are all part of the uh, channel of the Simplex Center. So, that's why I created the picture that way. And as you all know, uh, NYC, if you're wondering what that stands for, it's not New York City. It was called Network Yellowstone Corporation. Now I first made my uh, private channel, which I never uploaded on YouTube. I mean, it was never there. All I could do was just record and then just watch over it, and that's it. So that's been around for a while, and I still uh, look into it. Anyway, um, yeah, so for colleges, I think we're going to start be using uh, this app called Zoom, but uh, that's only used if you're going to do video calling, but it's a good way to communicate. And if you're wondering about Deer Days, we are no longer using doing Deer Days. That's out and over with. Um, we have been prohibited of our county feeding the deer. Because that's what we'd be doing. I started filming it in uh, late summer of 2018. My first car wash video was uh, the Futura SSA. I recorded it off of uh, my first computer that I ever had and created that uh, channel off of called a Voyager 3. 
It's a little com it's a little computer, not like a big one. You know, like uh it's like about this mere size. That's the size of my uh, Voyager 3. So, also, I plan on doing another uh, train DVD action collection. And uh, my uh, junior year for painting. Excited for that. Also, um, all there's open is just grocery stores, and that's about it. The gas stations, right now our area is just uh, $1.99 for just gas. That's about uh, as low as they can get. Well, some of my uh, No Limits 2 videos, for some reason, uh, wasn't very popular. I know not everybody's very interested in lightsaber baseball, and I, I totally understand. So, a new thing that I did after lightsaber baseball was a uh, high jump golf course. I only did one episode. But, I'm thinking about doing more. I can't really multitask very well. It's, sometimes I just get focused on one thing, and then forget the other. That's how I am sometimes. What's new is, uh, I got a special light that I could look under cars. It's very special. It's unbreakable. I know everybody got one, almost, but it's this LED portable light. Also known as the drop light. It contains at least 120 volts AC. It'll never dim. It'll always be bright. This is one of the best lights I ever got for Christmas. And much more. Ah. Uh, what else? Oh, also, a new GoAnime video is coming out. It is, ca it is called uh, Rush Hour at Metropolis District Attorney's Office. It'll be uh, made with a whole new world be inside a uh, District Attorney's Office. Maybe not so much of a black uh, background, but a new thing that I'm going to do is with 3D objects. Yes, 3D objects. I know you guys cannot wait to see it. I will be uploading that soon, so it's coming. You'll just have to get your hopes up. That's all I'm gonna say. And there's much more to explain. This uh, coat, I usually wear this um, during uh, spring and uh, fall seasons. Yep, everybody recognized my name. Curtis, that's who I am. So far, um, we've been traveling to 
like, out of this state. Like, Illinois and Wisconsin. Well, the reason why we went to Illinois was just to go rail fan. Like, I kind of wanted to explore a little bit of the Norfolk Southern. So, and I did, which was a miracle. First time I saw a Norfolk Southern train, ran through uh, a special place in Illinois called uh, Stampton, I think it is. Yeah, that's where I saw that train, but at that location there was no crossing. Another thing that I want to mention is, um, the kids thing, the videos made for kids, um, some of them will allow comments, and some of them might not, but I know some car wash video fans are kind of disappointed in, uh, one of my car wash videos when I hit uh, just for kids, that it might not allow comments. Which, I was really shocked to uh, see that. So, I might have to cancel that. But for my real fanny videos, I usually have that, uh, I usually have that just for kids also. It's because that I can get more viewers. That's why I'm doing it. I'm not ca Let's see what else I can think. Well, I've talked about COVID-19. I've talked about updates. Um... What else? Also, more Path to Star Killer is coming out too. By the way, even though I've recorded some, I still need to do the uh, animation. You know, like the Star Wars theme. Another thing I want to mention about King World Century is this. If you're wondering, uh, what is Simple Expedition? Well, Simple Expedition, this is my full name for Simplex Center. Simple Expedition, like exploring. It's not really for fire alarms, which was originally, but It's like, uh, exploring new things every day. Like, so what's going on in the world? Uh... Where I'm traveling to? Uh... Which location? Which origin? That's the travel that I've been, uh... Doing. So that's why I called mine, uh, Simple Expedition. Because most of my time, sometimes I travel. Like, uh, Mall of America trips. And lots of fun things, too. Also that, uh, Valley Fair place. That was also kind of fun. I mean, really fun, I would say. I would go on all the roller coasters there. Like, my most favorite would be Wild Thing. Because, uh, Wild Thing has these longish track, and it's fast, and it lets you take a picture. My second favorite would be Steel Venom. Because you get launched up in the air, and then you just 
get forced back down and forced up the other way, up its tail, or well, not tail, but its head. You know, like the head of the snake? That's what the uh, 2006 commercial was about at Valley Fair. Steal Venom. At first I thought it was Wicked Twister, but until I read the sign and wrote on it, is when I realized it was Steel Venom. So, those two rides were fun. And then my third favorite was... Uh... Corkscrew. Yeah, Corkscrew was also my favorite ride. Because you go upside down on the loop-de-loop, -loop, and you kind of do a swirl once, and then you do this uh, loop like the uh, Pepsi Orange Street get to Mall of America, known as Nickelodeon Universe. At Nickelodeon Universe, I was kind of disappointed that they took down that uh, Atomic Collider. I really missed that ride. I rode that thing since I was about eight, all the way up until I was like... 18. That's pretty much what I can remember. So, I will warn you this. If you are sick, just remember you have to stay home. To prevent the virus, keep a good distance like 6 to 10 feet away from the person who is sick. But our government says, uh, stay home. So, that's what we're doing. And that's why I'm going to be posting all these videos, mostly at once. So, that's going to be coming up pretty soon. Stay tuned. And hopefully you'll have fun. But I'm not finished yet. There's more to talk about. My original videos about uh, GoAnimate, also known as GoAnimate, was a uh, animation that I made. But not the website called Go Animate. What I did instead was put the two words Go and Animate to Go to Met. I first uh, made it from uh, this app called Keynote, where you do the animations. But now they do uh, recordings. But I don't use an iPad anymore. So what I did was, um, I started making uh, my first video off of there. My pilot video, I should say. Which was, uh, Yacht and Nacing beat up an angry German kid. It was about, uh, two Japanese kids. Wanting to have a Gatorade bottle. So, uh, they aggressively asked this, uh, angry German kid named Leopold to hand it to them, but he wouldn't. So, they threatened to beat him up. And then, they did it anyway, after like three seconds. Was it three or ten? I, I don't remember. I think it was like ten seconds. Then they did it. And then they got grounded by their mother. For their punishment, they got uh, launched away on uh, Superman the Escape. 
So, another thing that I'm going to do is also my uh, first trap students thing from government that was originally made from 20th Century Fox after the Jack's Journey. Then after the Jack's Journey, I did uh, some just audio work. Audio work about uh, engines speeding up for doing one bad thing to one engine or conductor. Then I would uh, like record music, like uh, ACDC. Uh, Starship and other rock music. But ACDC is my most favorite. So, another thing. I got one more thing to add. I got one more thing to add. Don't worry. This is my last subject. What else? Hmm. I'm kind of thinking. Well, I can think of one thing. It's on part five. I decided to, of Jack's journey, to use, um, Real people voices. Like, I asked most of the students in, uh, my classroom to the voice recording. Like, them performing as other characters. And, uh, I know at least three of them were, well not three, but four. Four of them, I believe, were uh, the sidekicks of the characters. Like, uh, Bailey Searden. She is uh, Moff Searden's wife. Bailey Searden and Moff Searden both create troopers like a storm army, storm troopers in their own headquarters I know that was kind of inappropriate for me to mention that but that's how they were made what I also plan on doing is a uh, court trial for uh, Ma Searden. So that might come soon. It will not be on 20th Century Fox, it will be on King World Century. That's where uh, the movie is going to be. And then I might plan on uh, remaking that uh, Jack's journey into, uh, exploration with Jack McCoy. In other words, I might also put the title as The Search for Moth Searden. But I'm kind of wondering on what you guys might call it for, uh, my movie of Jack's journey. Would you call it, um, The Journey of Jack McCoy? Would you call it, uh, The Search of Moss Searden? Would you call it a Excursion to Finland? Jack's Vacation? Or Jack's Destiny? Those are what I'm kind of thinking about for the 
for those titles of one movie that I'm making. I know one of the movies that I'm going to make is The Trial of Moff Sirden. But right now I am making a Rush Hour Panic at Metropolis District Attorney's Office in Minneapolis. That's one that I'm focused on right now. I'm not going to worry about anything else until I get the uh, movie done. So, that's what's happening on the Simplex Center. Stay tuned for all those videos and educational television. I can't wait to uh, put a pilot episode up of educational television. I mean, this is going to be a huge, huge blast. And hopefully it'll be successful. For educational television, um, will be like what you see on the top uh, list of the uh, Simplex Center. So, that's why I called my channel Simp Simplex for not to know. What do I call it? I meant, uh, my list for the Simplex Center would be Educational Television, Simplex 4351-20, No Limits 2, and Empire Builder. The other two channels, King World Century and NYC, will be separated. NYC would be a broadcasting channel. But I once had it for movies for a short while, but it's always been a channel. I had great luck with it. So that's pretty much all I'm going to say right now. Hopefully, for those of you who are sick, hopefully you guys will uh, feel better soon. I mean, I know it's really hard for you. I understand. But hey. Sometimes, once in a while, you might be thinking, um, you might want to watch something. Who knows? There's plenty of videos out there, including mine. I mean, feel comfortable, whatever you choose. This is the message from uh, the main channel called the Simplex Center. There's a new feature also as for uh, Movavi. Yeah. Movavi. That's what I've been using most of the time for uh, my YouTube videos, except for uh, the episodes and some of the pilot. My first pilot episode, which was uh, my train action collection, which was my pilot movie, like I said before. My uh, premiere would be uh, that Braider subdivision, but it'd be chasing a coal train from Motley to Staples. But we caught it. Wasn't really going as fast. So. That one movie that I used was, uh, Cyberlink. Yeah, Cyberlink, um, I haven't had good luck with it very much. I had great luck with Movavi. I mean, I had no issues with it except for, uh, I think that one video about, uh, car wash video 
Clear Lakes. Yikes. But anyway, um, that's my full story and what's gonna happen on the Simplex Center. So, thank you for all tuning in for this special announcement. I hope I will see you guys soon here on the Simplex Center. Bye everyone!